If guacamole and chips are a favorite, this bento is the perfect way to repurpose a lot of taco night leftovers. Hey, welcome to Mama Bowls. If you're new or if you've been around for years, I'm Laura and I'm so excited that you are here. This whole month, I'm sharing quick no cook bento ideas with you for back to school and you're gonna be able to whip those up in about five minutes and I'm also gonna share with you the tricks of keeping those lunches packed fresh until lunchtime. So make sure to hit that red subscribe button and the bell so you'll be the first to know when the other ideas are live. The great thing about a big lunchbox like this is that the bigger compartment will hold all my chips and they won't get crushed in transport. I'm simply gonna place my chips inside the compartment and next to the chips, I'm adding guacamole. Now I've just bought a single wok like this, but of course, if you make your own homemade, make sure to place it in a separate compartment on the side or a small lidded container. Now the olives I place in a small container like this because they contain moisture and I don't want my chips to get soggy. So they are going to have a little lid just like that and my chips will stay dry. If packing lunches is a struggle, I also have this free printable lunchbox builder for you in the description box. It's gonna help you build really quick lunches by mix and matching the ingredients that you already have on hand. For bigger appetites, make sure you send a sandwich and something else just so your kids stays full longer. I'm also gonna pack some red bell peppers in my lunch. Depending on the container that you use, you're gonna need a bigger or smaller slice of bell pepper. This one's too large, so I'm just taking my knife and slicing it into smaller pieces. And now it fits in the compartment where I want it to go. I'm also gonna add some cherry tomatoes. I forgot to add some green bell peppers, so I'll also grab a few of those, slice them smaller so they fit, and color adds nutrition to any lunch, so in there they go. And to make this more fun, I'm also adding some cheese on the other compartment on the side. Now before I place the lid, I wanna make sure that my chips don't get crushed, so I often move them around, place a couple more right on top, and I take my lid and close this lunch. Now, since you packed the chips separate and everything, anything that had moisture had a lid on it, I can place this in the refrigerator and make this the night before. And in the morning, all I have to do is grab the lunch container, get an ice pack, place it at the bottom of my lunch bag, put the container, any drink, and anything else you're packing, zip it up, and this lunch is good to go. Don't leave yet, there's more. Watch this next bento that's also a breeze to pack. See you next time.